Okay, I'm going to show you how to calibrate a variable pitch tail rotor and rotor flight using a piece of paper. I'm only covering the mixer calibration here. At this point, you should have already set up the tail servo and linkage in the servo tab. I have this receipt that I found. You can use a sticky note, bigger piece of paper, whatever you got. Fold it like this so that we get this 45 degree angle here. And this acts as a 22 and a half degree pitch gauge. I have the tail blades on, heli is powered, and I have them folded forward so that we can more easily see. And I like to start off with the yaw center trim at zero, yaw calibration percentage at 25, and the angle limit set to 30. First thing we want to do is turn on mixer override. Make sure yaw is set to zero in the override. And we need now we need to adjust out the little bit of counter torque here. So adjust the center trim until they're parallel. Just right about there. And now we can adjust the override to 22 degrees clockwise. And as you can see, this doesn't fit. So we need to increase the calibration until it does. Right about there. And then save. And now we can go ahead and straighten out the tail blades. So we don't have to worry about them hitting anything. And we will change the override to negative 60, which is 60 degrees clockwise. Now we can increase the clockwise blade angle limit until the pitch slider gets very close to binding, but not quite. Hear the servo buzzing, back off a little bit. Now we can override all the way in the other direction and repeat. So in this case, I can actually go a little bit further. It's not unusual for some allies to have to reduce this. So in my case, I'm going to bring it up. There's binding. Back it off. And there we go. Save. That's it. It's calibrated.